Inner Life by Srikanth Reddy The bear stopped dancing and unscrewed his head. He held it upside down in the dusk. She reached into her pouch for a copper piece, but instead pulled out the silvery piece she'd been saving for some special occasion. A limited issue stamped on one side with the profile of the prince, on the other side a water wheel did not spin. It glowed in her hand. Her hand grew heavy with it in the salts and the bittersome oils of her hand. Was this the occasion? The others were there, with their fists in their pouches, and the weary bear held out his head as if it were an offering or an object lesson. It was neither. It was ripped with russet handfuls of animal's hair pasted on and a secret eye slit recessed in its open maw. The wild old man in the bear suit parted his lips and out came a snatch of extinct bird song. The musicians clapped. He'd learned it as a boy growing up in the mist-proud interior where he would call and call until the violet males in a frenzy swooped into his breathtaking nets.